My father developed the TOG rating system for duvets. <laughs> wow. That's, wow. That's, that's great. I hope this is true. Are you very familiar with the TOG rating system? I was a very rebellious child and I <laughs> uh, made, it, made it brutally clear to him that I had no interest in and the TOG rating that, system. Having said you'll have picked up a little bit of information over the years and probably could share it with us now, couldn't you? So, <laughs> roughly, <laughs> what, what is that? What is... Virtually, this is, this is the first I've heard fine. of the TOG virtually rating system, Bratty. But it's bringing back horrible childhood <laughs> memories of my child, <laughs> of my father, age four, trying to explain the TOG rating system to that's me, fine, because which you said... I think is abuse. <laughs> well, what did you do before your dad invented the system? How were well, they rated? People, people had blankets, didn't they? Blankets and oh, no, downs. Oh, no, 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 no. He, he, they had he duvets. didn't invent duvets. He invented, saying he invented no. the, the, the he rating system. He had an office system. next door to the guy that invented duvets. <laughs> <laughs> you know, in our house, we have two duvets. We have two medium-sized duvets. And through the winter months, and this is the fascinating part of it, <laughs> through the winter months, we have the two of them, and they're poppered together around oh, the yeah. outside. Got, and we're still with them now, I'll be very honest. I won't lie to you. But in the <laughs> summer, we take off one of the duvets, doesn't matter which one, put it away in the mm. cupboard at the top of the stairs. Do you wrap it in a bin bag? Yeah, well, my wife does. I, yeah. I don't do it. <laughs> and then we have the lighter duvet. So for us, the TOG value is largely irrelevant. It's just a question of how many duvets have you got. That's such an incredibly rude thing to say, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> to a man like you, it's just going to be who invented the rating system, you're yeah. saying it's, it's irrelevant. <laughs> I want you as, as, a, as a grown man, which I think we can all assume you are, <laughs> do you now prefer the duvet or continental quilt, as some people still call it, or the blanket? No, oh, I've, I've always just blankets, it, because it, it's a rebellion thing. And under the blanket, when you're lying there, are you in pyjamas, or are you, as I'm picturing, <laughs> naked with a pair of... a little pair of briefs, possibly, or <laughs> let's go the whole nakedness? Are you, what are you wearing? Uh, what did you wear last night? Tell me... <laughs> basically, describe yourself naked to me and the nation right now and tell me what we can picture. Uh, no. <laughs> I imagine you have pyjamas. It's pyjamas. Stripey pyjamas. He's your pyjama man. Definitely. Do you have a teddy yeah, bear yeah, as well? No, I don't. Because when I picture bear. you often, what? I think of you, you, you with a little teddy bear. You imagine me with a teddy bear as a grown man and still having slippers. a teddy bear. I could imagine you as a teddy bear for a much larger man. <laughs> And I, I mean, the truth is, the truth is, the way I sleep is I dress as a teddy bear and then I snuggle in the arms of a giant. <laughs> what do you think, Lee? Take a guess. I think, what do we think? No? I think he's lying. I think he's lying. Yeah. Okay. Saying lie? We'll okay. Say lie. David, uh, were you telling us the truth or were you telling us a lie? I was telling a lie. <laughs> <laughs> Would you believe it? You can hear the shock in the audience there. <laughs> <laughs> it was a lie. David's father did not develop the TOG rating system. As I'm sure you all know, David does not even have uh, something as newfangled as a duvet. Instead, he gets his butler to heat up the sheets with a warming pan. <laughs> I